Hello and welcome. Today I'm going to cover a loophole that exists in Unix that allows you to modify files even without having write access. Well, for this, I'm assuming that you already know the basics on how to get to the Unix and Linux shell terminal, that you know some commands to manipulate files, and that you know the basics of Unix or Linux file system permissions. Unix and Linux are great, but they are not perfect. And here's one glitch that you should be aware of. So right now I have two sessions. One of them is a root session and the other one is a session with a normal user, in this case my user ID. So um, I, ha I have a directory which is absolutely empty. And say I want to create a folder called secure. When I list it, it says, well, you know, my user has created a directory called secure and I can see this also on my root session. That's great. Now, as root, as the administrator, I'm going to access the secure folder and I'm going to create a new file and in this file I'm going to put a message say this is a secure read-only file. Now I'm going to save it as secure.txt. Now, just to, be, just to be sure, as you can see my file here, here says that the owner still can write. Let me change that. I will assign read-only permissions to secure.txt. Much better. So now the owner can read only, the group can read only, and others can read only. Great. So what can I see here? I enter the secure folder. I can see a file that has read-only privileges. I can read the contents, which is great. So what happened if I try to write? OK, let me use vi. VI, for the people who doesn't know, is a text editor, a very um, old text editor that does amazing things. So once I edit this file, I'm going to try to put a new file. It gives me a warning, changing a read-only file. Well, I'm just going to ignore that, and I'm going to write, are you sure about that? And then I try to save and quit. Well, it allowed me to do that. I check the permissions, they are still the same, but when I check the contents, wow, it wrote actually what I was editing in VI. So why does this happen? Well, some commands only require that you have write permissions to the containing folder, regardless of the permissions of the file. What do I mean by that? As you can see, this containing folder let me make it clear. The secure folder, I have write permissions because I am the owner. Or other people, uh, if the permissions are set up to write for everyone, it will be the same output. But because I can write in the folder, I have privileges to override the permissions of the files inside it. Allowing directory access to other users can be really dangerous. So please be aware of that. But that doesn't mean that every single option or command that I have will work. I went back to the secure folder. Say I want to put a uh, ha 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 message here. And I want to append this to secure. It tells me the permission is still denied. So as you can see, not every option is available. Some of the ones that are available is the move command, the copy command, and as I show you, VI. And so far, that's all I have tried. Well, um, I think this concludes with a warning to if you're in charge of security of your system, make sure not only to ensure security for the permissions of the file, but also of the containing folders. Thank you for watching.